my name is Rosie Herrera, and I'm a professional dancer and a choreographer. I have a dance company, and I heard about this workshop because I have a dancer who is a Franklin teacher, and she was talking a lot about it. And so a bunch of us came, well, a bunch of the dancers came yesterday, and they had these amazing experiences. And they called me like right after, like you have to come, you have to come. I wasn't gonna come, but based on their experiences and how profound they were. I was like, I would definitely have to come. So I came today with no sleep, but I had a really amazing experience. And um, it was really, really interesting for me to learn specifically about the one aspect that she spoke about, about anatomy and about how you have to synchronize the verbal cues that you're giving yourself with exactly what your body is doing and how powerful even like a simple phrase that you hear all the time in a ballet class can really affect uh, neurologically what you're telling your body to do, even if it's the opposite of what you're supposed to be doing. So seeing the bones and just seeing how they work, and I'm very tactile, like you can't tell me something and then I understand that I have to see it, I have to touch it, I have to do it, I have to manipulate it. So that was really helpful to see how the pelvis moves and how the sit bones move apart, which is totally blowing my mind because I, it was just something that I never even thought of or didn't have any knowledge of so it was really enlightening to see that and then I just like I especially like the exercises at the end with the ball and just um, what I what I said I don't know if she, I said it or she said it I'd like to think that I said it but um, which is just exercises to enliven or to awaken the nervous system because especially for me in the past year I have a really hard time warming up <laughs> And I've been a dancing, dancing for a while, and I, you know, dance every single day, and every day it's like the same thing, and it's like, you know, you're trying to get your body warm, and then it just, it feels like you're working against your body, against what it naturally wants to do, and even though I do the same exercises that a year ago got me warm, they're not doing that now, and it's because, um, like she said, I'm, I was taking the time to warm up my muscles, but not waking up my brain and saying, hey, you know, come on, we're gonna work now. Like, let me give you some attention. Let me give you some attention. And those simple exercises with a ball, just telling your body to wake up, it can replace hours and hours of warming up. So, I liked it. It. <laughs>